this is just a quick update. Most of uh, my equipment is in the, you know, is on another job right now. This is uh, my mother. She bought a uh, weed whacker for uh, her rental property. There's they cut the grass there, like the tenants cut the grass, so she got a, a new weed whacker for them. Black and Decker, electric, I'm not a fan of electric, you know, you guys know that I pretty much know electric equipment. This was the old weed whacker. Let's try to sell it, but I don't really want it. It's two, two twine. You can see. And uh, so she bought this one brand new. One twine. It's good for edging because the property is like in the inner city. Winbrook is uh like a uh, it's like a like kinda like Queens. You know, there's not the properties are all postage stamp properties, so there's like no grass, and there's you mainly have to do most mostly weed whacking. So that's why they bought a she bought a weed whacker. I would have bought a gas when I was telling her, but she didn't want to deal with the gas, and tennis probably didn't want to deal with it either. So, cause you have to drain the gas and everything. That I got to return that gas can. And uh, this is the mower. It's dirty, I gotta clean it. I gotta cut the grass today too. I may do it now, I don't know. It's early in the morning. My backpack blower. Snow blower. You know, I took a customer of mine, lets me keep most of my equipment on at his property because I'm working there. And I got equipment on another job, so a lot of it's not in the yard. There's a snowblower. It's all covered up because we're taking it apart because it needed work. So that'll be running in another week or two. Wow. Not for my tractor. Someone else's. Um, these are my signs that go on my trailer. Not, not this trailer. Oh. So, this is my hand aerator I just got. I'm gonna repaint it, same colors. I may paint this, the handle, in black. Cause I'm, I don't, my color's not red. My color's are that. And I'm gonna probably put JPC all over this, take off this Craftsman decal. And this is a little bit bigger than what I had. I don't know if you guys saw the other trailer. And the tires are much fatter. You know, it looks shorter, but it's really not. It's actually the same size, and it's actually a little bit bigger. But I need to make a piece to go on my tractor. That's why I haven't been using it. But these are the wheel weights for a tractor. Mud pan. Blocks. Firewood underneath it. That's a mower. My Toro. GTS2 mower. Recycler. It's like... That's the one I painted stump grinder on. My cones, but everything else is in here. Some tarps. See what the yard's cleaned out. Chippers gone. Everything's out of the yard, really. There's nothing in the yard. Things gone because the snow, the chipper, is at my father's shop. He fixed it. By the way, chippers. All done, fixed. There's uh, it, it, it didn't need a lot really. It needed um, three, four of these little uh, things that look like three fingers with uh, a bar that was holding the three things together, and the blades would go through these three things, three uh, piece of metal things, and he had to replace four of those, and then uh. He rebuilt the carburetor, and he bought a new blade, because one of the blades are junk, and he sharpened all the blades, and everything works now, so he's going to be bringing it back, and I got a few jobs I got to use it on, so 
I just need to get the tow bar, so I told him to get that. So he's gonna get the tow bar and everything, and I get tow with my tractor, the jobs and stuff. So I'll be using that. That'll be coming back. The snow blower, I'm, I got I got working. I'm just waiting for the parts, uh, and then we're gonna put it back together, and that'll be working. The snow blower needed a few things. Needed the belts to spin the shafts. That's why the shafts weren't spinning. It needed uh, a plastic thing for it to spin the, the chute. Uh, some WD-40, needed a, a carburetor rebuild, and that was about it. And uh, the other trailer, my old trailer, I brought back to the guy. I don't need that no more. So I brought that back to him. And this is my new trailer. So this is what I use now. Oh, and the other trailer's not here either. The, the wagon, that's on a job. My, two, my green wheelbarrow's on a job. The other uh, red wheelbarrow's on a job. My, the other half of my cones are on a few jobs. And, uh, and shit like that. So mo every, most of everything is on jobs, pretty much. The other mower I have is on a job. The craftsman. You guys never saw that. You, just got, you guys just saw the bagger in the garage. Yeah, that's all. I got that fixed too. It needed a uh, a cable, just like the red mower, the Toro GTS two, needs a cable too. So I got to fix that. So most of everything's uh working. I put to work. Put everything to work. Things uh, on jobs. Oh, and the spreader. The spreader's on a job. The aerator, the, uh, the lawn plugger, I should say, that's on the job. I leave the lawn plugger there, it's been there all year. And, uh, that's about it, really. And everything is, uh, working. So I'll give you guys a video of when I'm, uh, I'll give you guys a video of, uh, when I go to the to the job with this thing and I'll show you all the equipment that I can store in this guy on this guy's property and the path I built it's a pretty sick job pretty big for what he's got to do but I'll explain that to you guys when I'm there alright see you guys later